začínáme teď. Which can ease data manipulation, and if you are juggling a lot of data in your application, uh, it can really shorten your code and make it more comprehensible. Uh, in Python, uh, we often deal with uh, nested values, and if we want to access them, uh, it's uh, a little inconsistent depending on uh, uh, what shape the, the data are. Uh, and you can get at least three, three types of uh, runtime errors. Uh, if you, if, for example, bar doesn't exist uh, in the in the dictionary. How can uh, we make it better? We can use GLOM, uh, which uh, can take your data. You pass a, a path you want to access, and you get the value. Uh, if, uh, for example, some key does not exist, uh, you get only one runtime exception. Uh, if you don't want to, uh, you can you can pass a default value. So, in case uh, something doesn't exist in the path, uh, you get the default value. Uh, you can uh, also transform data easily. Uh, for example, you have this uh, data structure uh, with planes. Uh, the key planes contains a list uh, with, uh, of the dictionaries that have uh, names and seeds, keys in, the, in them. So um, you, can, uh, you can pass uh, a path, uh, then specify what keys you want to get, and then you can specify a function you, you would like to apply on them. So you can easily get uh, one result with the number of seeds in all the planes in the data structure. Um, if you want to take a more object oriented uh, approach, you can use uh, a T object which contains. Uh, <coughs> like a um, copy of your data and you can apply functions and uh, transform your data that way. As you can see, it can be really short and uh, really readable. And that's all.